Okay, so my 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 hack, the thing that I have done, is I always am trying to try to make great uh, results or good results with the minimum uh, requirements possible. And with Ecamm as a software, I really like to try to use the creativity and explore the software in order to achieve the results that I want and my clients could want to, to have a better performance. So I have been in, inspired with all the, the videos and always I see the animated countdowns as something that I really would like to have, but just because I'm a cheap guy, I don't want to expend some money. So I was thinking, how can I do a good um, intro uh, countdown uh, with animation so that it's easy for, for everyone, for me to go, go live and also to teach my clients on what they can do with Ecamm. So without further ado, I will try to explain what my setup is and what have I done in order to have my intro. And at the end, uh, I will show you the, the actual intro. So first start, and I will try to show you the equipment I have. I have my Canon M50. It's my camera with a, a lens. And right now it's with the aperture of 22. Uh, I have my MacBook and an external uh, display. Sorry for kind of dizzy uh, image. And then I have my uh, arm that uh, holds my microphone with a pop filter and my Logitech webcam. So I think it's quite a simple setup that anyone could have. One computer, uh, one camera and the we one webcam. And for for the mic, I have this one, the blue snowball. So having these uh, these cameras, I was thinking on how can I have my countdown? So we all have been there and we can make an overlay with the, the countdown timer, but I didn't want to have my main camera filming my image because uh, I can dance and it will not be such uh, an impact when I'm starting doing my videos. So I thought that I could use the Logitech attached to the microphone to show a different angle on the place I am. As you can see, when I'm doing my meetings and my webinars, this lo looks like almost a professional studio or something like it, it has been uh, prepared uh, previously. But if I show you the, the the Logitech webcam, you can see that this is this shows a different angle. And when I try to move my, my arm, uh, the, the thing is that people feel like they are inside my my studio that it's my room to, 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 to be to be quite honest. So I thought that this angle would be quite good to use and try, try to do my first um, image that I will be broadcasting. So over this, I thought that since it's colored and it didn't look like, it could look like this, this is the final image and that I will start broadcasting like this. So the thing that, that I did was just to adjust the brightness and I turn it completely down all the brightness and saturation. So now I have an image that it could be used to show that this is not final. It's not the final video that I have. I am for starting to do my broadcast. So I will start with this angle and then I will have another, another scene and my new scene will be where I am with uh, my uh, background and with my name and the, all my uh, the the URL from my website. And after this scene, I will have 
a third thing where my overlay will disappear. So I have right now three scenes. My first scene with the Logitech cam, where I will add um, a countdown timer. And for instance, it's something like this. So people will see that, sorry, I, I, I had it muted. So, but people will see that in this uh, mode, the time will start in 30 seconds. And when the, the timer goes to zero, I will go to the this scene where I can present myself. And then I start doing my live stream. Well, this is quite simple. It's just three scenes and they go quite, quite well. If you want to go and have an extra uh, layer of uh, security, security, I have a stream deck and in my stream deck, I had a macro with all these three steps to go to first scene, have a delay of 30 seconds, go to the second scene, have a delay of 10 seconds. And then I will use the third scene when I can start uh, talking and presenting everything. So Katie, 